Warning, drinking too much can make ugly people appear attractive and may cause premature death. Please drink responsibly. Welcome, friends, to another episode of... Drinking Games for Gamers! Gamers! Today's episode features an awesome first-person hack-and-slash multiplayer game that we like to call Chivalry Medieval Warfare. Eh. What? That's super clever. Did the game's called Medieval Warfare? And they drank mead back then, so you combine the two? It spoils the joke if you have to explain it. I swear to God, Tenant, if you weren't so perfect. Ingredients. One, beer. Since mead is actually pretty hard to come by these days, we decided to go with Newcastle. Mostly because of its name, but it also tastes pretty good too. Two, a copy of Chivalry for the personal computer. If you don't own this game yet, you should. It's fun as hell and pretty darn cheap to boot. How to play. Chivalry Medieval Warfare is a great game that can be played in any game type. If you die, take a drink. If you get killed by a ranged weapon, such as a bow, throwing axe, or javelin, take two drinks. If you get decapitated, headshotted, or fail an objective, take three drinks. And if you kill a teammate, you have to finish your beer. And next time, watch your swing, dick. Strategy. The best strategy for succeeding in chivalry is to be patient. If you go in flailing wildly, you get put down pretty quickly. Instead, get good at parrying and looking for holes in your opponent's defenses. Also, don't kill your teammates. You'd think this would go without saying, but you'd be wrong. Team killing happens a lot in chivalry. The best way to avoid it if you're using a melee weapon is to not use horizontal strikes when your teammates are around. Stick to stabs and overheads. If you're playing an archer, don't shoot at enemies who are already locked in combat with a fellow teammate. I don't care how many posters of Orlando Bloom you have in your bedroom, you aren't f***ing Legolas. Punishment. Oh, come on, I was totally blocking. As punishment for losing a game, you have to finish your beer. Sadly, not all of the maps are well balanced, so sometimes a loss is unavoidable. But hey, you did willingly choose to play a drinking game, so drink up. And that's Chivalry Medieval Warfare. Guaranteed to bring you hours and hours of bloody, limb-severing joy. Or deep frustration. Could go either way. So have fun, be safe, and we'll see you next time on... Drinking Games for Gamers! 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 Batman? Thank you, lords and ladies, for watching this week's episode of Drinking Games for Gamers Medieval Warfare. Please join us on the Book of Faces at facebook.com slash the warp zone and continue suggesting your drinking games there! I need more scotch.